Hey, what's up? This is Scott with Level Up Tuts, and today we are going to continue our WordPress basic series by moving on to uh, another part here. So in the first part, we showed you how to install it, then we showed you how to create and manage your content, right? We were adding and editing pages and posts. Now we're going to talk about some more management type things. So right now, up until this point, we've had one user and it's been the admin. What happens if you want to have somebody else join you in adding posts on this page? Well, if your site is local, uh, obviously that won't you know work out too well. Uh, but if your site's up on your server somewhere and you want to make an account for somebody else, to come in and either edit or write or have all of the same access level as you um, or even different access levels, you can certainly do that. So to get into this, we're just gonna need to go uh, back into the back end. So by clicking on your page title up here, takes you back there. Now, we're just gonna go down to the users tab. Now we have myself here and it has my role as an administrator. I have two posts and that's pretty much all the information I need. And what's important here is that my role is administrator. Now in the next video, we're gonna talk a little bit about roles. Uh, but for instance, for right now, we're just going to create another new user. And so let's click this add new button right now. Okay, and now this is just going to be an account for somebody else named Scott. And uh, this can be for my Gmail account. Um, and now website, sure, it's just gonna be level up tuts, although that doesn't really display it anywhere. Now I'm just gonna make a uh, very weak, quick password that I can make sure I remember. And uh, I, you can choose if you wanna send this password to your new user by email. This is really nice if you're creating accounts for people and uh, maybe you know they're not setting them up themselves. That way they get their email. Sometimes I'll have a password that's change me or something just so that when the user gets that email and sees their password is change me, they're unlikely to leave the password as change me uh, because of course that's not secure. Whereas if maybe you had it as something uh, for them, they might, you know, maybe just leave it. Now notice we have the role dropdown. We can have subscriber, contributor, author, editor, and administrator. We're gonna go over the uh, the exact details of all of those roles soon. However, I'm gonna just select editor for now. That way we can at least see editor in action. So let's click add new user. Okay, we now have Scott, and sure enough it has my other Gravatar, uh, which is a little bit older picture of me, but it's still me. And now let's actually log into this site with the Scott account. So I'm just opening up an incognito window here just so that I can uh, have a uh, session that's not already been cookied here. So we have Scott and then my password. And now I'm logged in. Notice how things look a little bit different. The menu, not only is it a different color, but uh, you'll notice that this one has considerably more options. And that has to do with the role here. So like I said, we're gonna go over roles in great detail in the next video. But for now, just know that this is how you can create new users that can go ahead and log in and do things to your site that aren't you. Now also, if you wanted to just delete this user, you could go ahead and click this delete button. It's gonna ask you if you want to delete the user and all of their, uh, uh, do you wanna delete all of their posts or do you just wanna then attribute all of their posts to admin? The, that way, you know, if, uh, you don't, you know, you don't want to delete the content that they actually produce in your site, you can certainly do that. Or if it was some sort of harsh uh, departure and their content was terrible, you can delete everything. So as always, this is Scott with Love Love Tuts. If you have any questions or comments, please leave a comment in the video. Uh, reach out to us on our, our forum, Facebook, or anything like that. We'd love to hear from you. So thanks for watching. In the next video, we're going to go over roles in detail. Thanks. Bye.